So how did this happen? How did we get this thing? How did racism start? First of all, race is a recent invention. It's just a few hundred years old. Before that, yes, people divided themselves by religion, tribal group, language, things like that. But for most of human history, people had no notion of race. Did you know that the English word slave is derived from the word Slav? Because Slavic people were enslaved by all kinds of folks, including Western Europeans, for centuries. Right? Slavery wasn't about race either, because no one had thought up race yet. So who did? His name is Gomez de Zorara. Portuguese man, wrote a book in the 1450s in which he did something that no one had ever done before, according to Dr. Kendi. He lumped together all of the people of Africa, vast, diverse continent, and he described them as a distinct group, inferior and beastly. Never mind that in that pre-colonial time, some of the most sophisticated cultures in the world were in Africa. Why would this guy make this claim? Turns out it helps to follow the money. First of all, Zarara was hired to write that book by the Portuguese king. And just a few years before, slave traders, here we go, slave traders tied to the Portuguese crown had effectively pioneered the Atlantic slave trade. They were the first Europeans to sail directly to sub-Saharan Africa to kidnap and enslave African people. So it was suddenly really helpful to have a story about the inferiority of African people to justify this new trade to other people, to the church, to themselves. And with the stroke of a pen, Zarara invented both blackness and whiteness because he basically created the notion of blackness through this description of Africans. Other European countries followed the Portuguese lead in looking to Africa for human property and free labor and in adopting this fiction about the inferiority of African people. I found this clarifying. <laughs> Racism didn't start with a misunderstanding, it started with a lie. 